friends, welcome back, Regal Smith here. And today I wanted to walk you through my house and show you how I use essential oils on a daily basis. So we're gonna start here in my bathroom and I have this essential oil set that I use on a daily basis. These are just some of my favorites. Over here I have, um, this is my travel set. So I travel a lot, at least before 2020 I did. So everything I have is in here, my makeup, my hygiene, uh, my skincare, and I just wrap it all up. This folds up, which is really awesome. And I can just throw it in my suitcase. So what I use on a daily basis with doTERRA is I definitely use their Barrage Cleanser. So this is what I use to wash my face. I then tone and use HD Clear. So this is great for breakouts. And then I use the Yarrow Palm as a serum and a moisturizer. So this stuff is really great at helping to decrease fine lines. It helps with collagen production and it's a really cool oil. So this is my must have. So it's a pretty easy skincare routine right there. I also use the Yaro Palm Serum. So this is the body serum. So this is designed to go all over your body, not on your face. And this one is for your face. It has pomegranate oil with it already. So you can use it directly from that bottle. And I also use over here uh, the Mud Mask. So this is really great spot treatment for breakouts or to use a couple times a week. It helps to purify and cleanse the skin. I also have in here HD, or no, Correctex. So this is like an all natural neosporin. So for cuts, bruises, sometimes even puffy eyes. So I definitely keep this in my travel bag. Uh, the eye cream with doTERRA, the roll on, love this stuff. This helps with puffiness and fine lines. So this is the anti-aging eye cream. Highly recommend that if you're not already using it. And then down here, these are a lot of the travel things that doTERRA has. So the travel shampoo and conditioner packs. I have a little travel toothbrush and toothpaste, the On Guard. I have the On Guard floss down here. So all the things that I need to be on the go. And then a lot of these oils I like to also add to my bathtub. Um, Cypress is really great for circulation. This is a good one to add to your bathtub. Frankincense, the roll ones. Uh, Clary Calm, I use this every day in my armpits. This is like a, a natural deodorant for me and also helps with hormone support. So this is one that I use daily. And then my kiddo, she's four and she uses every day, she puts on the rose. I put it on as a personal fragrance and for some reason she's adopted it as well. She likes also the Neroli and then Magnolia I have in here as well. So she knows which one she likes to put on every day as I'm putting on my oils. Down here I have the On Guard uh, mouthwash. So this stuff is awesome. So if you are traveling, you can put this in a recycled On Guard bottle or On Guard hand sanitizer bottle. I also like to use in here some more On Guard toothpaste, of course. Uh, I have On Guard, or um, this is the Citrus Bloom Lotion that I use. The Beautiful Spray, this is another body mist. So this is great for moisturizing. It also could be a personal lubricant if you look at the ingredients much cleaner than some of the commercial ones available. I have every type of deodorant doTERRA has released. All the aromas so I can switch it up depending on the day. And then also the root to tip hair serum. So this is great to use on wet hair before styling or even I just put it on, you know, day old, two day old, four day old hair and comb through. Also works great on my little one for tangles. So moving into the shower, we have a lot of doTERRA in here. We have the shampoo, conditioner, body wash. This is the Citrus Bloom limited edition one. I have in here more toothpaste, right? I don't wanna have to dig around so it's everywhere. This is another version of the facial cleanser from doTERRA. This is the Essential Skin Care line. I like this one as well. And then the Reveal, if you guys aren't using this yet, this is like microdermabrasion for your skin without the time, spa, or cost. This is awesome. So a couple times a week, step one, then step two, and it's like a facial scrub. Then we have uh, a foaming face wash. So this is the HD, HD Clear line. I don't use this one as often because it can be drying, but this is really good for acne prone skin. Sometimes I use it on my back after a workout or different things, but I have one in here as well. And then the facial scrub. In here, I have fractionated coconut oil, this one. I added some Slim and Sassy to it. It's supposed to be good for cellulite, circulation, different things. 
And so I use this as a shave gel, not a gel, shave oil. So I shave with this and sometimes I even use the conditioner up here to shave with. And then of course, some more of the barrage. Don't drop the soap guys. Okay, so that is the bathroom tour. We're gonna head into the bedroom and I have essential oils by my bed at all times. I have um, whatever I'm diffusing for the week. I am doing lavender, can't go wrong with lavender, very classic, and magnolia on the bottoms of my feet. I also like to have a linen spray. So I have a couple of versions in here. This one is a Serenity linen spray. It just has a little tiny bit of alcohol water and I think probably 20 drop, drops of Serenity. This one is a similar one, except instead of Serenity, it has cedar wood and wild orange. Um, a miracle salve that I use with the essential oils and then a few of my favorite DIY blends for nighttime. Over here I have my every oil kit. So this is great if you are doing Symphony of the Cells, which is this fantastic book right here. So you can have protocols for different things uh, such as immune support, lymphatic drainage, hormone support, different things. So I have all the oils you would ever need for any of that in here. And then I can grab whatever I need. And a little trick is if you put the labels from the caps in the bottom, then you know which one is missing. So that's a cool trick as well. All right, let's head down to the kitchen. So we have diffusers in every room. On the left, my little kiddo, that's her room. And she has a diffuser in there that we usually put Serenity. We fill our diffuser in this bathroom, and right here we have the Serenity or Breathe. These are a couple of her favorites. We also have On Guard Soap in, by all the sinks, and then a Poopery version uh, by all the toilets. So this one I believe has, oh gosh, Lemon Eucalyptus and Elevation, but you can put pretty much anything in those Poopery sprays. Moving into the main room, this is our living room. We have right here behind me, my favorite chair is a little Brevi diffuser. And so that gets this small space over here. And then over here we have our big diffuser that we diffuse every single morning, all through the day. This thing is a workhorse. This is the Volo. And this will go for either one hour, three hours, or six hours. You can adjust the mist output, which is really nice. And then I usually put some of our favorite oils we've been diffusing. So this week we've been doing a lot of Harvest Spice for fall time and Clementine. Over here is my kiddo. She's showing me her Halloween project. She's making little goose, ghosts and goblins and ghouls to put in Hotel Transylvania. This is also my office. So if you ever see me recording a video, I'm sitting here at this table. I have a proper office in my house, but this is really the one that gets the most use. I have another diffuser over for this space. This is the Lumo diffuser with doTERRA, and then another set of oils here. These are um, some extras, a lot of the free products of the month oils, um, some others that I like to cook or diffuse with as well. And then, uh, of course, by the sink, I always have On Guard hand sanitizer in the kitchen. I actually use that sometimes on my fruits and vegetables. I'll obviously use it on my hands, sometimes cutting boards. And then, of course, uh, more of the On Guard soap. Down here, I have cleaning supplies, all doTERRA friendly, right? So we have the On Guard concentrated cleaner. And with that, I make concentrated cleaner to clean countertops. Um, this one is more of an all-purpose spray for glass. So there's vinegar, rosemary, grapefruit, lemon, and water in this one. And then extra On Guard Concentrated Cleaner. You can also make a soft scrub with this. So just some baking soda, a squirt of this, make it look like frosting, kind of the thick consistency of frosting, and clean your sinks. And then this is like a... Um, something I put baking soda and oils in and I put it on my carpet. So it's like a carpet refresher and then I vacuum it up. Over here, I do supplements and make um, drinks and food with my oils. So in here, we have all my supplements that I like to use on a daily basis. These are my kids. These are the PBSS Junior, Junior the probiotics. We have her chewables. And then in here, is what I take on a daily basis. So I take those supplements and I put them in here. And if you haven't done this yet, I highly recommend it. Um, so here's my lifelong vitality. I have the probiotics, the phytoestrogen, turmeric, DDR prime, Mito2 max, 
Terrazyme. And so everything's in here. When I travel, I can just take this whole box. And it's really easy to access and take on a daily basis. Over here are some of my favorite cooking oils. I love to cook and also some oils that I like to diffuse or just have on hand and have really close by. Um, in the mornings, I like to put turmeric in either, well, my husband's coffee or uh, I'll make a matcha latte with just some matcha. So some of this matcha, some collagen powder, mix it up and put the turmeric in it, just one drop. And then in addition to my kiddos vitamins, I have the omegas in here, which need to be refrigerated. Um, but these are the IQ Omegas for the kiddos. So those are some of our favorites. I will take you down, actually, I'll take you into the laundry room. So in here we have the oils that I like to add to the laundry, obviously the On Guard Laundry Soap. And then I like to add sometimes Wild Orange, Purify, Lemongrass, Citrus Bliss, put it on a dryer ball. And then this is just some water and lemon for funky smells just in the house. It's kind of like a air freshener. You can add a little bit of alcohol to it if you want, and that helps the oils suspend a little bit. Um, over here, this is kind of like my indoor garden, and I have a, a nice repellent that I made. Um, an easy thing that you can do to keep insects off your plants is just peppermint and water. It's a super easy one. I've also made one with uh, kind of like an aphid spray for this big thing that has baking soda, castile soap, I think rosemary, clove, and maybe peppermint to help keep that one fresh. So those are how I use them in my indoor garden. And then the last space I'll take you down to see is my gym. So I use some oils down there. How we start our day is a super important thing. So for me, I love to diffuse something relaxing like balance or uplifting like wild orange. Uh, over here, we have a really fun diffuser. My friend Monica made this for me. So it has my last name on it and then Bliss Mama, which is my website and my YouTube channel. And so we have some of the wild orange down here. And so this way into the gym, we have a little yoga setup. So down here I have some of the yoga oils that I diffuse when we're doing yoga. And then um, this is a little diffuser I use. I'm going to get the Rome, which is going to be a cordless portable one. And then in the sauna, a couple of the ones that I like to use are cedarwood and eucalyptus. So sometimes I'll put a couple drops on myself and go in the sauna. And then over here, uh, underneath, these are the three yoga oils that we have, Anchor, Align, and Arise. And then my final thing down here is just my mist. After I'm having a funky smelling day after working out, I just spray this lavender and eucalyptus on my bod, get ready to start the day do some relaxing stretches and I'm, I'm ready to take on the world. So I hope this was helpful for you. Thank you so much for joining us. I hope that was helpful to see how a real person utilizes the essential oils and has them in their house and hope to see you again next time. Thanks everyone. Bye.